I'm comparing two of Panasonic's most popular zoom lenses. Uh, the one on the left is uh, 12 to 60 millimeter. It's a 3.5 to 5.6 version. The one on the right's the 14 to 142, the second model. A um, little bit better optical stabilization than the older model, but not a lot. They both have uh, almost the same size body to them. Um, and both use the 58 millimeter filter thread size. The 140 is 265 grams, so it's probably about 60 grams heavier than the 60 millimeter on the left. They both are really comparable in feel and operation, but the uh, 140 is a little stickier when you extend the barrel. The uh, hoods are slightly different. The one the 60 millimeter version has a smaller hood. It allows for that wider field of view that you get with 12 millimeters versus 14 millimeters. Both keep the uh, optical stabilization in the lens. Just the 140 version has a switch where you can turn it on or off on the lens itself. The 12 to 60 came as a kit lens with my uh, G85. Um, probably between the two, the 140 seems to be a better range for me. Uh, the 12 millimeter width I usually cover with my kit lens. I bring it along just in case I need it. But the uh, added length of having the uh, 140 millimeter over the 60 millimeter is more worthwhile for me. I find that uh, that extended range comes in handy, especially for uh, getting a little more separation from a closer image. If you go to take a photo of something fairly close, you can get uh, a little better separation from the background and a better look to it. Between the two bodies, I, I was really surprised at how close the G85 and the GX85 are in total volume. Um, the GX85 is a little bit larger when you have the 140 on it compared to the 160 with the G85, but the weight between the two are, are negligible. As far as carrying it around, you can't see much difference in the two. If I had to keep one of the two, I really believe I would keep the 14 to 140. Unless someone needs that super wide range of the 12, uh, there's really no reason to go with that one. But optically, I, I can't tell a difference. When I'm shooting with it, looking at the images and replaying them, they, they're identical. Also, video is really close between the two. Um, the stabilization performs about the same between the two. I can't really tell any major difference in it. So the 12 millimeter probably helps a little bit at, at cutting down on some of the shakiness over the 14. Uh, but aside from that, it, it, I just feel like the 14 to 140 is probably the way to go with me and I'll stick with that lens.